Yo, what's up and welcome back to today's video where I will show you some of the craziest things that car mechanics have ever built, ranging from two Jay-Z swapped Lambos, two turbo swapped boats and jet skis, two scary off-road monsters like these. Make sure to let me know which build is the craziest in the comments and don't fast forward, stick around till the end to see what happens when you go a little bit too far. We're starting today's video off with a Hayabusa swapped golf cart. Yes, you heard that right. This thing is no joke and gaps drag cars left and right. Also remember that none of these clips are either set up or fake. Have you ever seen a turbo snowmobile drag race? Well, here is one. Remember the big turbo 2JZ swapped Lambo? Well the same dude turboed his forklift and it shoots flames. Over 99% of you guys watching my videos right now aren't even subscribed yet. So if you enjoy these kind of videos, I would really appreciate if you like this video, subscribe and comment hashtag outlaw if you are part of the squad. It really helps me out and only takes you a second. Let's get back to the video. Everybody loves that sweet 5-cylinder symphony from the Audi engines, but would we swap out the legendary 2JZ for it? Let me know your thoughts on this 5-cylinder Supra build in the comments. Coming up to our first LS swap of the video, here we have a 1952 Big Turbo LSX Willys really Jeep. Next up we got a car attached to its engine, this is a Holden VH with a blown 6 liter Chevy big block with meth injection and this thing is a burnout machine.
There can only be one fast boat in the river and I'm sure these guys are driving it right now. But I bet these guys have nothing against this turbo jet ski, just wait for it. Now I will show you two of the craziest Miata drag builds out there. First up is Black Mamba's Procharged LS drag build. This car hooks right off the line and is insanely fast. Next up is Mr. Tedman's V8 Miata, named the turtle, find out yourself why. Seven at 165 miles per hour. 837 at 165. Did you know that you can turn your steering wheel into a Beyblade? <laughs> Next up you will see two absolute nightmares of a car. A Miata and a BMW 5 Series off-road car build. Don't get confused by the sound. Racing your RC car. Generally, RC car races take place on a paved surface because this is where they perform best. There are many options for RC races, including parking lots, to race without asking. If you are going to be racing a truck, then a smooth surface will not be as important because they can be raced practically anywhere. This Lupu is powered by not one, but two 2 liter TSFI engines, which produce 900 horsepower each and is equipped with two DCT gearboxes. Subscribe and see you next time.